Sayla Hennessy reports from London. Speaking on the BBC on Thursday, British Foreign Secretary William Hague said the Egyptian government should take heed of demands for change. I do think that it is important in this situation to respond positively to legitimate demands for reform, uh, for order, political transparency, and greater political freedom. Uh, and that would that would be my advice to Egyptian leaders and to many others around the Arab world. Egyptians have taken to the streets for a third day of protest against President Hosni Mubarak's 30-year rule. An Egyptian cabinet spokesperson said Thursday that the police are showing maximum restraint in dealing with the protesters. But the head of New York-based Human Rights Watch said he said they are using open fire in the capital on Friday for a mass rally is planned. In a report published earlier this week, Human Rights Watch accused the Egyptian government of political repression and widespread discrimination against Christians and other religious minorities. Masoud Shajira is head of the Islamic Human Rights Commission in London. He says William Hague's comments on Thursday are not enough. Britain and the United States need to do more to pressure Egypt for change. Some way 